Welcome back guys to Mario plus Rabbids Donkey Kong Adventure as after dodging the deity hostility of the attacking idols we finally broke through to face Mega Rabbid Kong yet again in a final climactic battle but our adversary proved to be unbeatable by normal means as we unlocked a golden barrel to use ourselves as the ammunition for his defeat. However with the main story done the challenges now remain for its post game as we take on our chosen first battle Goatfish Gallimorphi. They have how much damage? 60 melee? I mean, I could use this, because it would maybe wipe them out. Depending. Kind of need to go that way, though. Well, actually, I can just pick up Rabbit Cranky after the fact, so... That's a thing too. Why am I not sliding that guy? Yeah, what am I doing? Oh, you get him as well. Then get him. Then come all the way back and shoot this guy in the face. I guess that works. I won't be in cover, but I should be able to survive a few rounds of being shot in the face and then heal. Don't fall down there, rabbit. It'll be fine. Just use your new golden weapon. So, like, half the enemies are defeated? We're going on an adventure. Where to? I do not know. To a place far away. We're going to be up this guy. Because it's fun. That's what we're going to do. It's far away from the smashers, right? Oh, no, they can get through the tube and they can grab two, I think. Isn't it? So they will go to there. So if I'm right in the corner, I'll be fine. <gasps> I think. I need to meet up somewhere and get a heal at some point. Depends who moves first. Do I want to use that or not? If the hoppers move first, I could end up blasting lots of them for quite a lot of damage. If the bouncers move first, I could end up getting horribly bounced. Oh well, risk it for a biscuit, right? Wait, Rabbit Cranky! I faced you in the wrong place! And I don't know why. Whoops. Okay, that's not good. You're taking an extra 50 damage for no reason. Don't worry, he'll get vamp. Ready? It's the hoppers that are gonna move first. How much damage did he just do? 91? <laughs> I can only hit him? Well, that sucks. Are these special hoppers? I didn't see him doing this that much damage before. Right, they just killed Ravage Cranky about any issue. Suddenly, mass amounts of damage is dealt. Equally, I would have survived with Rabbit Cranky. Remember, I don't need to get everyone to survive to win the challenge. But this does make it significantly harder. He weakened me. I forgot that they have all these different abilities. Yikes. 
It didn't matter for the later bits of the main story, but now it's actually mattering like a massive amount. I forgot about all this. Alright, so now my fishy terror is not going to do much damage. I mean, I might just want to straight retreat from everything on this turn with how things have gone. It'd be funny if I could still pick you up and chuck you. And it's too bad I can't pick you up and chuck you into a place I know you can't do damage to me from afterwards. Everywhere is pretty nasty now. Right, I think I've screwed up the challenge, to be honest. To be quite honest with you, about Rabbit Cranky, I don't think this works anymore. How did I mess that up so badly? I mean, I didn't see the water, and that's pretty much the damage that killed me. To be fair. It's too bad I can't check and keep moving. And because I'm weakened, I can't do enough damage to finish the guy. What an error. I don't really know how to get out of this now. Of that as well. I think I might just need to restart. I don't think there's a way out of this. I've just lost my main damage source. It's like losing Luigi in a sense. <laughs> yeah, that's that screwed. <laughs> I just bounced them next to the pipe, so they could use the pipe to come back over and kill me. <laughs> what kind of brains is that? I don't even have a clue myself. Let's go over there. I've got a different, a completely different start in mind from now on. Okay, cool. So a completely different start. How, how did I do that? I think my, yeah, I think my brain has truly melted away. There must be nothing left. Still not actually sure though. I think I need to come back to this with better brains at some point. Right, is that enough damage to kill them all at that range without summoning them in? Or should I just use it? I've got extra turns after all. That feels like how the start should happen. Because you're easily able to get six with that. And then I can still move, which means I can still take Cranky on a journey. Through time and space! To another place. Right, where am I making cover there? 
Okay. Maybe I'll only want to go to here. And hit like that. I even know what I was thinking! Why do I go out? Going all the way around that way seems a bit weird. So they can't hear a vision. Which is one nice thing. I can shield these guys to stop them doing anything. And it would be probably better for me to take out the higher HP guy and the lower HP guy. Because I can run down the other ones after. 100% honey, so we know we're always going to do more damage than the 80. Use that on this turn. We should just hopefully turn around and just shoot people in the face everywhere. Which I'm perfectly fine with. This is where I shoot Donkey Kong, by the way. It'll be terrible. Right, I'm not getting hit by spitting statues. He just got killed by spitting statues. That's kind of funny. He's gotta run left, right? And he can slide too. They have 100% as well. It disabled everything. What a get. Right, can I slide anyone from this range? No. Everyone is just ever so slightly out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, critical again. So this is one of the spots we've designated a safety zone. This should be safe. You have to not be enraged in your donkey. Alright, can I get around the entire map? No. I want to be up there. I'm going to slide at least one. I can definitely slide multiples, but then Rabbit Peach will be well in trouble. <laughs> ah, the terror you fed to me here. Alright, you may have hit the car, but you didn't hit me. Okay, how do I get into a position that I can get these guys and then be safe from everything afterwards? I don't think there is one. Donkey, I'm relying on you to do something here. Like, can you get her out of that horrible position? No. Depends where she ends her turn. I could just not beat one of them. And then make my way back. Make my way deep over here. I think no matter what, the hoppers can get 
around so easily. And I can't cure her now. So I'm trying to put them in a position that's way at the back so that they can just recoup and survive. What happens if I do jump on you? Do you get cured, do you? Guess that would be a thing. Oh, she gets cleared from that? Oh, there we go. She gets cleared from being picked up. Okay. We're on one side of the map. They're all spawning on the other side of the map. That guy got pushed to death. I feel like my brain's long gone for these challenges now. I mean, they can get close to me, but they're not going to be able to get into shooting range, which means I can now take the field and wreck them. And depending where all the smashers end up going, oh, they can get into shooting range, game. Okay. As long as I don't get criticals, eh? And you can bounce on two guys to get really close. What's you all going for rabbit peach, you meanies? I'm the one who's the only one who's supposed to have like the entire range of the map. But we can hit. I don't like this. Because they're all going to get separated. Okay. I still get full slide damage. So that is one big bonus here. So I will get that. And then... Shall I just get out of dodge? Shoot up this guy maybe? Be out in the open, but I can put on my shield. Remember, these guys can just ice us up. That's the previous guys, actually, but still. Okay. This is so confusing right now in how we're going to manage this. Essentially, I can fly in and hit so many people and then bounce them all into different positions and then I've got to, with Donkey Kong, do some things. <laughs> They've been spread out quite a lot here. Alright, I no longer have Weaken. Wait, why do I no longer have weaken? They definitely weaken me. Well, they definitely did, but... Obviously, they also did not. <laughs> I don't know how to put it. Alright, let's make a massive banana chain shot. With 100% bounce. Which seems a bit random. But it did, like, kill pretty much everyone. Oh, it didn't actually trigger Harry either. Okay, that was a thing. Do you want to keep you around here or not? I've still got a shot here to take. See, I'd like to end there. Really. I can't get the 100% KO on that one. Well, maybe it might just be better to leave. Fight something else. If 
Take a shot at this guy first, will ya? I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Go to sleep. And then we're off on an adventure. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just winging it now. I can hit you as well. Okay, which way is that blasting that way? Oh. I mean, that won't. That will do 60 damage, will it? Or will it do less? But it will lock down her shield so she can't go there, no. I want to hit that guy. I guess I'll just go to here then. I'm just taking everyone away. What am I even doing anymore? A grenade, maybe? I mean, it's damage. Must be more foes coming. But we're close to each other, so that's a nice thing to have. We're so close. Hey, put on your stupid shield. Will you get the bounce, banana? No. Yeah, you will. No, you won't. Right, they've both woken up. We still don't know if Donkey Kong can actually... No, 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 very no. So two, three bucklers and three summoners. Do you have hero shot again? That'd be great. Yeah, yes, you do. Right, you can break the shield first. This is so weird. Do I want to move you up first? Through the stuff? Well away from buckler men's. How can I get you this good? Nowhere really, oh. I want to do stuff that will supply you a jump, really. Because you can slide that guy and then you can get back through here. How far can you go? Like to there. Depends how far the bucklers can travel on one turn. Got no real guys we can slide. I'm just going in very weird now. We're just doing things. I'm hoping they maybe, just maybe, work out. That can hit everyone still, great. Let's go there then. This is so dumb. But at least I'm doing the damage. Alright, I can vamp to get some HP back off one guy there. I did chat that guy so good. I thought I didn't for a second there, I was a bit worried. Okay, I can hit you, no I can grab you. Technically it would make way more sense to grab you. Oh, you're facing that way this next turn? Oh. Let's just chuck you over here, again. I'd love for you to end up at the same spot. But it doesn't look like you're gonna, does it? Can the bucklers reach me from there? How far can the bucklers go? Oh, the bucklers can definitely reach. Whoa. Do they always have that much movement range? I do 40 damage in honey. I mean, you know what? I think I'll just survive anyway. I just don't know. I have to defeat them after that. Is 
So I pick him up, and then I move to... Wow, I have no good positions to move to, do I? The overall buckler movement distance, it does seem like there is best for Donkey Kong. So I really want to be there, because then she can just shoot everyone there. Oh, I'll just risk it again. Why not? I just realized I put Donkey Kong right in the firing line, which is so dumb. <laughs> yes, this is an amazing idea. Patented by me. Ah, oh, well. What's the worst we can do to poor Donkey Kong, right? <laughs> if I lose again because of this stupid choice, I'm on proper tilt. They are going first. Wait, he wasn't in range? Now you are! Now you're in range! You're in range now when you've gone through the point. Well, we got two. Right, you can't get Donkey. I actually think Donkey Kong will survive no matter what this turn. They didn't have their 100% critical honey. They got the honey. I mean, technically, I could just pick him out and that will remove the honey. Which makes perfect sense, actually. <laughs> Wait, you can reach Donkey Kong? But for some reason, you kind of chose not to. Alright, they spread out a fair bit. Donkey Kong can still move. Rabbit Cranky can easily get his, like, stuff back here. So that's nice too. What am I just beating up Donkey Kong all the time? Who's in range here? I kind of want everyone to be in range, but... It looks like that guy's two blocks away. If I could suck them into a mass melee, that'd be pretty sexy. If I melee, no one's in range currently, and I still have heal. And I have cars. How do I horribly butcher these guys in the nicest way? Well, first we move. If I come to here, I should be able to get most of our opposition right. And I'll check you to there, which will finish off one of our enemies. You're free. You're honey free. Okay. Now, if I call you all in. Bloop! Bloop, 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 bloop! Everyone's over here now! Join me! I'm sure you'll all be completely fine with this hit. Don't bounce away or anything! That would be dumb. Can I actually Rabbit Cranky reach, by the way? Oh, he can. Oh, but he can't get the bounce afterwards. 
Well, there'll be space in a second. I can promise you this. I'm going to ask the question, how many guys died? This... This was weird. Where'd the other guy go? Oh, there he is. Hundred percent from there. Sure, whatever. One, two, three. What a weird finish to our first challenge. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. And that was only the first one. Goatfish Gallimorfry. You get loons and money? Loons and money? So everyone gives me one loon? That's not too bad, actually. Well, we finally got one map down. One. Now we try to smuggle a strike back. One. I'm. This is kind of crazy. What am I doing? I gotta stop them reaching the point. But there's like 50 billion of them. Essentially, as long as they don't reach the tubes, we're okay, right? You can reach a tube on one turn. So this one has to die, and this one has to die. And this one has to die, and this one has to die. But we do have an instant honey chance on at least one of our guys. We could run down and chuck people at people too. And... If I'm right in saying, we could just literally stay here and... No, because that wouldn't get multiple targets. Uh... It's, it's the first turn. Right, I can also bounce with you. It feels like... I mean, I could put loads of guys to sleep. So we can ignore that whole side for a whole turn. That actually sounds pretty good, to be honest. Alright, so now they have chased distance of two, remember? It's only this side I need to deal with right here, right now. So we need to defeat as many people as we can. Down this side. So I think I want to magnet dance most of our guys in here. Yeah, that works for me. Maybe I'm going too over eager, I don't know. They don't get their chase distance, remember. So I can get three. That's perfect. That's good. Alright, so we do this this way this time. Do some extra damage to this one over here. Or I do it over here and I fight that guy afterwards because they only do a small amount of damage. But can I get back by the next turn if that's the case? I'm pretty sure I can with DK. <laughs> this could be risky. When there's anything I do not risky. Nowadays. I mean, aren't I actually betting on doing enough damage to these guys? And that bet itself could be... It's really risky. <laughs> there we go. We did it. It's fine. They're all beaten. Wait, they're not all beaten? 
Wait, what? I'm really confused. 9 HP and 9 HP? Well, that I was not expecting. Really? There was a bounce box behind there. Oh, I could have just slid them, by the way. Yeah, I could have just done that. That would have been easy. Oops. Well, I'm messing up all the time now. This is shocking. I can't slide those guys now. I'll wake them up, right? Can go up and slide that guy. Where am I jumping down from to slide that guy, by the way? That's a big question for me. Could just slid them. Didn't have to do that. Hit Rabbit Peach for no reason. What? All that direct. Wait, that's a ridiculous movement. Right, he can't move, so he's getting slid. I still didn't use any of my stuff, by the way. So they're all trying to get up there through the tubes. They've got a long way to go, but hopefully they're going to gather a little bit. Yeah, you should. Oh! No! Oh, no. Oh, very no! <laughs> Can I get you and take you on a merry trip? I think just about. Well, I can get you to bounce me as well. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, no, I can't because I will kill you. So I need to go to at least there. Which is there, right? Right? Because that always criticals now. It's 100%. So... That's a thing too. Okay. So now we pick you up. And we start going... Off on one. You've already shot. I think that'll be fine. Okay, remembering that we still got 100% honey. How far can I now go? Not far enough to get extra licks in on someone else there. Just a bit of a shame. I guess I'll put you up here. Okay. So I need to beat these two, which I will do with that. There's still a guy on the other side. Oh, no, he's dead. So it's only this side I'm actually dealing with now. Right, the best in terms of control here, I think, is... So he can't reach, but he can. So I just have to... I just have to finish that one guy off. And there's just two guys left. There we go. So no one can reach the pipe on this turn. As long as we don't do anything silly like giving them chase distance. Though technically they chase towards me and they wouldn't be able to move again. So I could have done that. We have what we call a very easy cleanup now. A very, very easy cleanup. Oh, 
not remotely within question. We have enough damage just from our normal melees. Without sliding with Cranky. Okay, challenge two. Much easier than challenge one. <laughs> much, much easier. I gotta remember to use these runes I'm getting here. And buy some more weaponry. Okay, that was easier. It's done. You can break dance all you want, sir. This is something about banana butchery. I would like to get the extra HP for my characters, to be perfectly honest. It's two down, ten more to go, plus ultimate challenges. Yikes. Okay, destroy bad bananas time. Let's remember to go to battle HQ. Right, we definitely need your improved punchy punchy. So you do extra damage to smashers. All purpose found a smack of all trades that cranks the damage dial to 11. Suitable for any enemy. Perfect smashes. Crank it up to 11. Shoot, I forgot the name of the parody band that that's... How can I forget that? How can I forget them? Should we get the bonnet-headed brute or an extra grenade? Whoa, sentry move range, six sails, 12 sails? Sure, oh, because it chases collectors. That's kind of cool. Let's get that then. What's the name of that band? All right, we've got five here. Let's increase the range of effectiveness. And bring them in the closest they can be. I really want to get more HP, but I'll do that first of all. Alright, uh, I, I, I'm pretty sure you could, yeah. Let's get more HP for Rabbit Peach. And then after that, we got Team Cell Jump Range to get as well. Let's get the fourth dash. That's 70 extra damage per turn. Alright, let's put our sleep. Make it better. Get the full HP for Rabbit Cranky. We have some more power. Can you read the description on Peach's weapon? Yeah, because I'm like thinking about that band. <laughs> Crank it up to a level. It's a parody band. <laughs> Damn it. They did, they did a song called Stonehenge. Ah! Why break? Spinal tap! Yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's fine now. It's fine now. Thank you, PJ, for coming clutch. There's no hiding from this predatory deployable thanks to its wide range of movement and 360 degree vision like your third grade teacher. Yes. Right, so we need to destroy bad bananas, not to kill people. Though it seems that all the bad bananas are being summoned. Yes, they have a summoner in every one. Why don't we actually start, by the way? Oh, we're all starting separate. Oh, okay. That means we can't do any combo. Where is Donkey Kong? Oh, he's in the center. Oh, you can, you can combo with Peach, but not with Rabbit. That sucks. Oh, and they're going first. So on the next turn, no matter what, things will get summoned. Oh, nasty. You only got it because of Stonehenge? That's cool. Okay. I think that doesn't make things better. Essentially, if we could get into a position where these guys are near each other, which is not going to happen now. I mean, I could probably magnet dance those two next to each other, to be fair. But I'd want to get Rabbit Cranky joined up. So he could do the bounce. Hello! And I guess at least the HP we got you basically affords you that one hit. Some other stuff is spawning. What? What is this? 
Yeah, sure. Sure, game. I mean, I can use my new shark to get them, to be fair. These guys are all about to summon in horrible amounts of guys. And I can dash past these guys and then just shotgun them. Or I could grenade and then do stuff. It's all up to you, really. Where can we get? <laughs> Whoa! We're on a trip! That is a trip! Wow, we can actually get to him! <laughs> Alright, uh, okay. Do I chuck him instead of have him use his movement? I don't know. We could definitely do a lot of damage to one set of bad bananas, but there's going to be a lot of enemies on map shortly. I should go for the middle one, shouldn't I, really? Okay. Oh, I could just go through this tube, by the way. I don't have to do that. Oh, do I want to... Hmm... Mm. I think I want to do that first, right? I know, have I actually not got enough damage now, when I think about it? Might just let Rabbit Cranky die. No, he does not have enough, enough damage to take these guys on there. Whoops! Peach! Can you get to safety? No? Oh, balls. We could just literally drive up and smash this guy and then see how much like melee damage we can do after. If we get the honey or not. I've done this wrong! Criticals! Didn't even get crits! I didn't even get the crits I needed. I mean I can beat one. Actually, no, I could beat them. Hmm. I could bomb these guys instead and ignore the. Oh, I got three. Wait, I've got three turn limits to beat the bad bananas as well. Yikes! I kind of feel like I do have to go in on you. Right, none of them can move. That's greater than all, surely, but... I need to do more damage over here as fast as I can. And then I need to get over there in, like, no time at all. I mean, I've done some significant damage to certain fac fac factors here. I mean, there's even been 20 damage done over there. Do I want to pick up an enemy? Do you know what? I think that's what I might do. I mean, I'll obviously slide all these because it will actually beat every single one of them. Then what I might do is come all the way over to here. Start shooting that thing. Because with these guys defeated, that's going to be a little bit safer. Then I'm going to pick up one of these, take them with me on the special magic ride. Can I bounce it off multiple guys? No. That's a shame. But I can bin one summoner. I don't worry, I, ha I have plans. I still have plans, so don't get me wrong. Okay, Don Kong's now getting hit, so that's wrong, but still. Do I just attack him from the front, maybe, instead, then? Eh, 
it, why not? That's going to be two of them defeated. And then if I use Stinkai, hopefully he moves and then I just shotgun the pile. So that's another one dealt with. That's the dream. Wow! So glad you didn't hit the push block, though. Oh, great. Up, 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 up. God, they spawn in at random points and they can move on that turn? Oh, that's fair. He's not even shooting me, though. Lovely. Adam Honey. Great. Wow. Is there much way out of this currently? She spawned over there. The <laughs> poor rabbit peach. She's had the time of her death. And they all got healed up too. <laughs> I so wish you grenaded that other thing though. I right, didn't get honeyed, so we've got some more better options here, I feel. Right. I mean, obviously, I want to shoot the bad bananas. Say, is there a shot on I can get where I can hit these? Yes, there is. But equally, is there an option? I mean, I can start my trip around the blooming world. I will critical this, won't I? But is it enough damage? No, it isn't, is it? Oh, it was? No. Not enough. So remember, we've got one that's low, and then we've got this one over here. So I think, first of all, I need to jump, bounce this. But I need to also hit that. You will get frozen. Can't help that. He's gonna make the run. That's one bad banana bunch down. Another enemy down. And I think I gotta take him and go on a trip again. All the way to over here. Do I have to leave him to fight this on his own? And go through. I mean, I can go through that and get that one next anyway. So it's kind of about Rabbit Peach and beating that. Or do I join up with him over here? Like, I've got to destroy this in, like, I've got a one round it ish. Should I just go all the way through and then one round it on the next turn? Had to be 60 and not six. Had to be 61 and not 60. It's 
It's kind of crazy, that. I mean, Donkey should be... F uh, Rabbit Kong should be fine, but he needs to get a vamp. That's kind of a problem we've got, currently. If he wants to survive. He will get one of his special abilities back, but it's going to be the story one. Probably could have slid someone as well, to be honest. And Rabbit Peach is in so much, like, mortal danger, it's kind of unreal. You can still vamp off the bananas, though, yeah? Right, we got 30 extra damage on the bananas. That's really good. I need to vamp your HP. Let me have it. And now you've got the actual bunch. So we're in position. We are actually in position to save it. But it's going to be really harsh. Very, very harsh. We need two people alive. But the likelihood of Rabbit Peach staying alive is very low. Considering they're all killing her now. Of course they crit. Now here's the thing, they should all go for Peach. Which works. Sorry, Rabbit Peach! What an annoying ability to use right then. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna grenade me too. Alright, our third turn becomes real now. Oh, you can actually get close enough as well. Oh. You don't have any status effects, do you? <laughs> Honey! I don't think he has cleanse, does he? He doesn't have cleanse. Like, if I jump off him, I don't think I get cleanse. Nor can I get far enough close to any of them to actually do the damage. Wow, what a way to lose! I mean, this is the best I can do, is hope that that cleanses him, but that was sick. I don't know how close I can get. Is there another way out of this or not? It's not with like the other structure of things, is there? I can't attack one and then go attack another. I think this is all I can do. 
but 100% I'm out. Oh, it does clear him. Okay, maybe I can make it. I don't know though, can I? The question is, how long is my grenade throw? <laughs> so that is like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine cells. So wait, if I go through here and get to there, is that going to be good enough? I said this is the, this is like the only hope I have is if I can chuck him far enough that you can grenade the bad bunch over there, but I don't think he can. Wait, what if I chuck him to there? Can he grenade that guy? I think he can grenade the guy from there. Can it hit though? Is this something I can do? Well, like even from here because I can 100% hit that and then I stop there and I check him to there and he can grenade that Can I randomly save this? I still have my attacks, right? <laughs> oh my god <laughs> <laughs> well, that was close. <laughs> I didn't think I could clear that way, but I can, so fine. Barely. Barely. <laughs>